What's up everybody, welcome back. I'm just here in my garage, you know, with my Ferrari and Rose. How you doing? I'm not really feeling that great right now. I think I got a bug. I was um I was in Texas this past weekend and one of my greatest fears is being in water that is really deep and I can't see the bottom of. Like I always you know, my mind just like starts going, what's down there? So, I had never been in this deep of water. I was, go, I was in a lake and I was floating there with my buddies. And he tells me that it's 40 feet deep. I almost had like a mini panic attack. Anyway, it was a blast. Um, I just got back. Picked up some snacks. I want to show you guys some snacks. But I think I picked up a bug. That's what I was wanting to tell you. I think I got a bug from like the lake. So I'm kind of stuffed up right now. I'm not 100%, but that's all right. So this is what I'm snacking on at the moment is these pumpkin seeds. And I, you know, these are freaking awesome, man. Especially this brand, Simply Salted. Look at the macros though. So calorie dense, 17 grams of fat, six carbs, minus the three grams of fiber. 12 grams of protein and a ton of magnesium. Uh, many of you guys know I'm on a ketogenic diet, so I do use MCT oil in the morning. Or if I get hungry, if I like, you know, hey, I want some more energy. MCT oil, man. It's not bad. You just, I just swing it back. Uh, sardines. Can't go wrong. This is a great brand. Of course, you want to get them olive oil. There's 1,300 milligrams of omega-3s in here. Wild Planet. Is this Wild Planet? No. This is Season Brand. But Wild Planet is another good brand in King Oscar. So, guys, the secret weapon for those of you who have been on this channel for some time. 100% chocolate is um, a great... It just makes you feel really good. There's a lot of benefits, even from the bitterness of the chocolate. Look at the macros. Take a look at that. So there's only one carb. And we know that because we subtract the fiber and get us one net carb. And it also has like a little bit of caffeine, thermobamine, it's bitter. Um, it lights you up, bro. So, and a kale shake, I probably have about, what do I have? Probably half a bag of this a day. So, a couple snacks I like to enjoy feel strong. And the last thing, I know what you may be thinking. That looks fucking disgusting. But it's not, alright? These are oysters. I probably have these like twice a week. And the reason I eat oysters, they're high in zinc. They're gonna make you feel fucking strong, dudes. And when I eat this, I literally feel like my balls expand. A centimeter. I feel like they just, they're full, because you need zinc to, to produce optimum testosterone. You need zinc for a lot of functions. So I'm going to stop putting this in your face, but go out and try some oysters. They're not disgusting. They're actually really good. You put a little hot sauce on them. No big deal. All right. So it's Monday morning, and we're going to get the momentum going right from the start with this brilliant book by a brilliant man, Brian Tracy. It's called Blue, Bull's Eye. The power of focus. Thin little book, heavy hitter for that daily wisdom. Clarity, focus, and concentration. You have the ability right now to achieve more than you ever had before. As long as you incorporate three essential mental skills into your life. Clarity, focus, and concentration. You must become absolutely clear about who you are and what you want. You must focus on your most important goals and activities. And finally, you must concentrate single-mindedly until you have completed your tasks and achieved your goals. These are the three essential requirements practiced by all successful people throughout history to accomplish extraordinary results and great achievements. Fortunately, each of these skills is learnable with practice and repetition, just as you can develop your physical muscles through hard work and concentration. You can develop your mental muscles through continuous repetition. 
Your aim in life should be to achieve all of the wonderful things that are possible for you. You want to score big to hit the bullseye, the center of the target in everything you do. In the pages ahead, you'll learn how to unleash your powers for success and accomplish more in the next few months than people do in a lifetime. Let's begin. Let's do it, bros. So, straight up, man, when he says, you must become absolutely clear about who you are and what you want. That is difficult. And that actually um, took me, is taking me some time to figure out. It's like, I know that I want to do a lot of stuff. But let me focus on what's working. Let me actually systematize. Let me put a system to things so and plan so that they actually work and I can see progress. You know, I've been making videos for a while and there comes a point where I got to ask myself, is this a hobby? Is it just a hobby or am I going to take this thing seriously? You know, when I created the monk mode box, that, fuck the box, dude. It's not a box. Like, I went in there with no experience in business whatsoever, guys. Like, I wanted to sell a box, and I was thinking, okay, I'll sell ashwagandha, and I'll ship them a book. Little did I know that that's going to cost me way too much. A lot of you are from all around the world. How am I going to pay for shipping? I can't do it. So, it's got to be a digital product. Fuck the box. It's not a box. It's a service, dude. I want to provide you guys with a service, right? Bringing together the community, helping you get the best body of your life, you know? And um, so that's what I'm working on. And it's scary, but I, I have to actually, like I said, plan and find out what works. You must focus on your most important goals and activities. And finally, you must concentrate single-mindedly until you have completed your task and achieved your goals. I visited this guy in Texas over the weekend, and he was just telling me, like he runs his own business and they're making... They're growing, dude, rapidly. He was saying, you got a plan, bro. You got a plan. You got to take this seriously. You got to think about what you're trying to accomplish. Get back to the roots. And then tie it all in. What is Monk Mode about, guys? I want. What do you guys want to see? What is Monk Mode for you? The videos. You want to see more vlogs, workouts. We'll do... I'm thinking we're going to do a couple, maybe we'll do a vlog in the beginning of the week. Maybe Mondays will be Monk Mode Book Club. All right, so let me know what you guys want to see because I really, you know, I want to do my best to live this Monk Mode life and share that with you so that inspires you and builds you up. So that focus, that system of what works, this is what we're about. This is what we're about, Monk Mode is about this fitness, health, being social, peace of mind, creating wealth, living a good life, finding out those pillars, bringing balance to your life. What is yours, all right? Find your, what is your place right now? So, let's get to work. So, obviously that 488 Ferrari is not my car. This is my car. Little Mini Cooper, six speed, three cylinder turbo. And to be honest, dude, like, look at it. It's orange and it's beautiful. It's a beautiful car. But it's ruining my clout. It's ruining it. For the last three years, I feel like I've been having a, like, it's like having a stain on your shirt you're carrying around it's got this cool little secret department but it's uh you know i want just a, a regular car preferably black maybe white maybe silver but manual because manuals sick but that's really it man god bless Minnie. i've been blessed man this last three years with this vehicle um you know, getting me around, but this is the end of the lease, so it's time to turn it in. Let's do it.
they say, bro, if you come out in nature, spend some time in nature, catch some crawfish, put your toes in the river, you're going to, like, recover if you're sick. So, trying to recover up, get better.